Hey guys, so today we are looking at this, which is a Infinity Wars gallery, um, Doctor Strange, PVC a diorama. I know that because it says it there. There we go. Um, okay, this has got slightly bashed in the box, but then it has been put back in the box for me to do the unboxing of it in the box. So yes, uh, side art, there we go, artwork on the back with a Mr. Cumberbatch there. Doctor Strange, as the Avengers and their allies have continued to protect the world from threats too large for any one hero to handle, a new danger has emerged from the cosmic shadows. Thanos, a despot of intergalactic infamy. Oh, I said that alright. His goal is to collect all six Infinity Stones, artifacts of unimaginable power, and use them to inflict his twisted will on all of reality. Everything the Avengers have fought for has led to up to this moment. The fate of Earth and existence itself has never been so uncertain. This approximately nine inch PVC diorama of Doctor Strange is based on his appearance in the Marvel Avengers Infinity Wars and features collectible quality sculpting and paint. Designed by Nelson X Asen Asensio and sculpted by Gentle Giant Studios. There we go. So yeah, diamond select to the bottom there. And the usual artwork on the side there, Mr. Thanos, Dr. Strange, uh -huh. and ooh, warning, this product is produced for adults, collectors, and is not suitable for children under 14. There we go, all the usual bump on the bottom. So, like I say, looks quite nice in there, but I shall pop him out of the box, and we shall see what we are dealing with. Now, I have to admit, I do, I do like... I do like Doctor Strange. He has. It, it was one of those when they said they're doing Doctor Strange. I was like, okay, we will see. And then they said Cumberbatch was doing it, and I was like, okay, that's that's interesting casting. And yeah, I enjoy the film, and I really enjoy the portrayal of him in Infinity Wars. So yeah, he has. He, I, I am. I am glad they got it right. So there he is. There is Mr. Cumberbatch. All right. So let's have a closer look. That's that face. Let's bring the lights in, lads. Let's do this like we're professional. There we go. That light around there. That light around there. Excellent. We can see now. So, I am thinking that beard is a little bit... Oh, it's not too bad. I've seen where it's painted. Eyes are quite nicely done. Um, eye of Agamotto. Nice bit of dry brushing on his robes there. And also around his legs. Nice paint apps on the straps on his boots. And yeah, I like the... This This looks like, I, I personally, this... I, I would give this a bit more of a wash. Some darker colours in there to bring out this detail. But still, you know, for what... These retail for between 40 to 80 quid. So... Yeah, work out where that is, where you come from. Um, you have one of his mystical spells on there. I like this bit as well, that's, that's I'm swinging in the breeze. And he's attached to his hand, and he's permanently attached to his hand, so you won't be taking that off and putting it on anywhere else. Um, straps on his wrist there, nicely painted. His cape at the back here has a nice level of detail on it, as you can see from there. Very nice. And has a bit of dry brushing and a few dirt washes on there as well. And here we have the base again with these pipes which are kind of rubbery. So, not metal obviously, duh. This PVC. Uh, inside of the cape there has patterning on it as well. Um, nice detailing, I forgot on the way down. On the top of the cape there. Maybe we could do a little bit more gold. See, I'm a perfectionist, so I, I, if you know, I, I will probably paint that in, probably create that little bit of beard there. But other than that, the eyes are quite good. That's my one thing. If the eyes look good, then it looks real. That could make they could maybe do with a little bit more gloss on. And he's painted quite nicely. Got those little grey streaks down the side. Yeah, and a nice, a nice look of Mr. Cumberbatch about it. I definitely think that, and that's. That is a great picture there. Dun, dun. Ooh, I'm going to take a picture of it like that. 
That's going to be the thumbnail for this, I can tell. Yeah, I'm impressed. I like it. I think, you know, for the cost, that stood on a shelf. It certainly has a nice dramatic style to it. And I believe they are doing some of them as well. I think there's a Captain America and a Black Widow and a few others. Um, they are readily available on Amazon and probably other great retailers that you can find. Let me have a look which other ones they're doing. They're doing a Captain America and Black Widow. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, that is a very nice figure for the price. And if you have enjoyed said video, what would be really nice is if we would use your eye of Agamotto and see that little logos that pop up that say subscribe click on one of them it would really help the channel it's great we're on four four nine four hundred and forty nine subscribers today let's see if we can get to the 450 let's see how quick we can get 500 we'll have a big event when we get to 500 somebody asked me why we didn't have one when we got to 400 that's just because it's 500 when we do the big event so yeah so i hope you all have a great day I hope you have a great night. I hope you all press the subscribe button. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye now.